Thank you for clicking on this video, hanging out with me. I got my pumpkin spice latte here with a pumpkin pie latte. I decorated a little bit for fall. I am beyond ready for fall. It's one of my favorite times of year, the fall and winter seasons. I'm definitely a fall and winter person. Christmas, the holidays, give me all the comfy, the cozies. And today I'm gonna to be sharing and doing an unboxing of the FabFitFun Fall 2024 box. Somebody calling me? Sorry, you guys. This is the third box that they sent to me. So they reached out, asked if I wanted to be part of this. I said, yes, of course. I love working with them. I got sent their spring box, their summer box, and now their fall box, which I'm really excited. I'll show you guys what's inside. If you're not too familiar with FabFitFun, it's basically a subscription service. They have four seasonal boxes, winter, spring, summer, and fall. And in each box, you get six full-size items worth, I think it's like $350 when you combine the cost of everything. And you get to choose them. You get to choose between categories of beauty, wellness, fashion home lifestyle some really great uh, like luxury more expensive brands than something that you would find at let's say your local TJ Maxx I think the concept is really cool because you get to try different things at a much more affordable cost if you sign up for the annual membership so you sign up for the year four boxes you save on that but with my code you're also going to get a free gift worth over $200 if you sign up for just the seasonal like let's say you want just the fall or just the winter then the box will come out to $55.99 I believe it's $56 for the fifth box for the first box so if you just want to try it out you never tried it out before this is like your first time ever with the code the this entire box will come out to $56 and you get to choose all the six categories. I think it's kind of like a first come first serve basis and I'm kind of a smaller creator so I wonder if I got everything that I chose but I'm really excited so let's open it up. Ricola. All right so this is what it looks like everything inside I'm gonna take it out one by one and show you guys what is in here. Let me take out the largest item first. So the largest item that I see is Sunday Citizen Blanket Throw and I really wanted this because I love throws. I feel like you can never have enough. So for the six options for the box, you do have different choices. So let's say for option one, it'll be this blanket and then other options. I chose the blanket and then you go on to option two, choose what you want, you go on to option three. That's kind of how it works. So you're going through six different options and each option has a list of things you can choose from. So what I like to do is I go on the website of the items and to kind of like read a description. So I went on Sunday Citizen and I read about it and I thought that I would absolutely love it because like I said, you can never have enough throws and it sounded like it was super duper cozy, almost like barefoot dreams. This, I cannot wait to use this. Very similar to Barefoot Dreams. If you've ever touched Barefoot Dreams, then you're probably very familiar. It's like a Chanel type material. It's so soft. You can see through it, like it has the little holes you can see through it, so it's not super close knit. It's a little bit more looser knit, but I love this neutral color and it's just so soft and cozy and I feel like you can't, you can't have enough throws. I feel like this would be really great to snuggle up with on the couch, with the book, in your bed, on a chair, whatever. I'm really excited to add it to the couch here. So this was my first option. Love, love, love that. And this is the second item. These are Mucklux, I believe the brand is. These are so cute, cannot wait to wear them. I got a medium, which was a 7-8, I believe. I didn't want to get a large, because a large was 9-10 and I'm an 8. So hopefully these fit, but they're very, very lightweight, super soft and cozy, very reminiscent of like a platform Ugg. It's not something that I would wear outdoors. Number three is, I think these are earrings. These are from the brand Ellie Vale. And I believe these are silver. Yes, these are silver, water resistant, hypoallergenic, stainless steel, like a simple silver hoop. I'm actually lacking in silver jewelry. These are the only silver uh, earrings that I have. And when I'm wearing things that are more silver, I really have no silver jewelry. So I saw this and I was like, oh, I'd love to. So. I got these, I'm really excited to add this to my jewelry collection. I feel like you can never go wrong with a classic hoop. I wanted to insert this clip here because I realized I didn't try the earrings on and I totally cut up for the video. So I'm including this here. The earrings feel very solid. They're lightweight, but you can tell they're solid. Like they're not hollow. At least they don't feel hollow, maybe they are, I don't know. And I like the clasp that it kind of clasps down instead of having the backing. I don't love the backing type earrings. These are one of my favorites. They're just easy to put on and they're more comfortable in my opinion. And you can't go wrong with a classic hoop. They also had a silver one, I mean a gold one. <laughs> this is the silver one. And they feel very lightweight and just add a little bit of something. I feel like I really needed some more silver jewelry so I was really excited to see this as part of an option. The next one is Glossier. They had a, I believe it's a lip gloss or a lipstick soft touch lip cream 
and it was in this gorgeous maroon shade i've never tried glossier products but i've always wanted to and this would be perfect for fall it's not something that i would veer towards because it's more like a brownie red let me try applying it right now all right i had to go in the bathroom and apply it because it's actually it was a little bit complicated and i probably wouldn't naturally veer towards something like this but i think the color is absolutely gorgeous and would probably work on a lot of skin tones perfect for fall time it's like a maroony dark red like brown red option number five is I couldn't resist. It was a skincare product inside of a pumpkin shaped container. It's from Tony Moly Retinol Eye Cream and I actually wanted an eye cream. So when I saw this, I was like, absolutely. This is like the cutest little thing ever. Oh, it smells nice. Oh gosh, it reminds me of something. I don't know if it's Alemis or Sunday Riley skincare. This smells like something that I've had in the past. I just literally can't pinpoint it. I'm gonna put this on my exposed skincare like where you can see it in the back because this is the cutest thing ever. And then option number six is the One Kind Dream Cream Nighttime Moisturizer. This nourishes and repairs with rosehip oil and squally. I chose things that I felt like I would actually benefit from. They have some really cool options if you're not into skincare. They had like purses, bags you can choose from, I think some uh, coffee type tumblers with a ceramic coating. I just felt like I already had those things and I wasn't looking for those things so I kind of chose options that I felt like I would actually get use out of but they do have like every category out of the six options. You have a handful of things to choose from and you're bound to kind of find something that you like and each thing is varies in price. They had some Alemis I think cleansing balm to choose from. Just like really great options. So when I saw this nighttime moisturizer with rosehip oil and squalane I really wanted to try it out, like a moisturizer for the face. I just applied it to the hands just to kind of smell it and get a feel for it. And it seems like it'll be a nice, thicker nighttime, perfect for the winter time, those dry winter months. Those are the six options that I chose. Again, they have so many different things that you can choose from. If you just want the one box, seasonal box, with my code for the first time, it comes out to $56, which is a really good deal where like something like this is going to run you more than that. I'll leave any codes and links down in the description box. but. That is what I chose for my fall 2024 FabFitFun box. Thank you again to FabFitFun for reaching out and sending over my third FabFitFun box. I hope you guys enjoy this video. Thanks for hanging out and I hope to see you guys in future videos.